studying at CG was a great experience. I enjoyed coming to school. I enjoyed uh, having a uh, school family. Missionaries find that when their students get a little older, it's really hard to do homeschooling. And when they find out that there's a, a quality English education that's Christ-centered here at CAG, they can stay on the field and they can keep doing the work that God has called them to. It was such a wonderful blessing to not only be able to serve in this country, but to find a great school for our kids. There's a global dynamic happening in the classroom. There is, there is a richness in that diversity that comes into the classroom and it provides a great learning experience. We have good education here. I like to make friends and read. I like to do math. It's Christian and the teachers are fun. CAG has been in existence for over 40 years. And our mission has pretty much been the same uh, since the beginning. Uh, we want to provide excellent English education, but at the same time uh, prepare the students for Christian service. The school was set up primarily to serve the children of, of missionaries and um, and I think that continues to be that legacy. The curriculum and the uh, standards here are very high. Our school is an accredited school by ACSI and Advanced Ed. We want to make sure that even though our students are not in the U.S., that they receive the highest quality education possible. And we monitor that education through standardized testing. So far, I'm proud to say that our school does meet benchmarks in these standardized testing. Students are receiving the education that is the foundation for college. And the desire for the faculty is to see the students grow up and leave this place loving God. Academically prepared, yes, but loving God first and foremost to be able to be prepared for life. It's a Christian school and we can talk about Christianity and we can go to chapel to honor God's name and praise Him. Once a week we have a chapel and then right after the chapel we break into small discipleship groups. And then throughout the year we also offer many spiritual retreats. There is always that relationship of building their spiritual life and making sure that the student as a whole is being taken care of. Uh, it is a very unique community. There's a lot of diverse cultures, people from all over. All the kids recognize me and I recognize them and it's not so big that they get lost in the crowd. All of us really rely on each other and so it makes it feel like your home. There's a lot to do, there's a lot of activities, lots of sports. The country is beautiful, you know, with the volcanoes, the mountains, uh, the, the coast. There's so much to do and to see here, and I think um, having our kids uh, in this country and the experience they've had uh, is just incredible. The people are very kind and generous. There's also a lot of opportunities to serve and help other people. I'm going to become a missionary when I grow up so that I could teach them about God. I think I want to go into mission work. We have many different missionaries that have come down, called by God, and come to Guatemala for many different reasons. Um, some of those reasons are that they want to be involved in an orphanage, um, they want to church plant. Uh, we have many feeding programs throughout Guatemala, and there's many, many other ministries that, that our missionaries at CAG are involved in. El centro fue construido y fundado por misioneros. Trabajamos en programas especiales de alimentación, de refuerzo escolar, clases bíblicas. Quiero dar gracias a todas las personas que nos han ayudado en este momento. Gracias por todo lo que han hecho por nosotros. Gracias por todo lo que han hecho por nosotros. It's a wonderful place to come and really feel like you're part of something bigger than just this campus. When you have a staff that comes with a heart to serve Guatemala, to serve missionary kids, to serve third culture kids, it's the best starting point. Well, we do offer a small stipend to help with their living expenses, but beyond money, um, we offer a lot more. One of the benefits we do offer is accommodation, so um, if you are a family, we'll find a housing for you. Um, we do have housing here on campus as well for, for single women. And this is a place that allows them uh, to become part of a team right away. And then there's some other smaller benefits which would include like our Cubby Care program 
that allows uh, teachers to have their kids here on campus with them all day while, they, while they're teaching. My teachers are very understanding. They also are willing to always help. I don't know of anybody here that isn't doing this because they really, really want to. You can have that sense of gratification that you're not just teaching during that period of time, but because you're serving in a missionary school, you're encouraging and helping missionaries stay on the mission field. It really comes down to three things. The first is that CAG offers a very supportive and loving community that respects the teachers. And that creates a relationship and partnership with the teachers in the classroom for academics and even for spiritual formation. Second, CAG has an incredibly committed staff of teachers and they work individually with each student to provide a high level of learning here at CAG. We also work with each other, creating relationships with one another, mentoring one another, and making sure that we're growing in our relationships with Christ. And finally, and most importantly, CAG educates an amazing group of kids. These kids are beautiful, but they need to be nurtured and they need to be matured in their academics and in their relationship with Christ. Whether you're a first time missionary, been on the field for many years, and everyone else in between, we want you to be a part of what's happening here at CAG.